Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back for another episode of Zero City. All right, so we got a, a couple things built. So we have a experimental lab made, and this is gonna get the let me see the researchers um, in here for training. So what we honestly need to do is start getting our population up because right now we still have five slots open, and I already know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna go ahead and have all the slots filled. And then all of a sudden, we're going to start having some of the uh, dwellers on the outside coming in from, you know, whatever. So we're going to go ahead and get that done, which is not a problem. Now, we could build us a couple things here also. We could build us a kitchen, which is going to train cooks, which is very necessary. Um, we will watch some ads. Let's open some crates. And there's a lot of stuff we can be doing right now. We can still fight the guys, the monsters, and everything like that. And it's always a good thing. But I think what we do, if we get some more gear... What is this for? Infantry. Perfect. But it's not even any upgrades. No upgrades right here. All right. So we're going to have to start fighting a lot because we have to get our, our barracks up. And it's like one of those things where I'm right now and I'm in a, I'm in a stalemate right now. So it's kind of like we're stuck a little bit. So what we're going to do, we're going to build our kitchen real fast because we don't have anything else we can build. So level six command center is going to get built. But we got to take care of all these other buildings that we have right now. So this is three hours. And we don't need food right now, so what we're going to also do is do a little bit of uh, editing. Go ahead and move this around. Move this around. Where's the... Okay, there's a remove. We'll put the kitchen there. And then we'll have the refrigerator there. That's pretty much the storage. All the storage units and everything are going to be on the outside. I'm going to have everything set nicely once everything gets said and done. And I'm pretty excited about that. Oh, the kitchen has roaches now. Zombies. Oh, that was roaches. I said, oh, no. Oh, no. All right, so once we get our population up, which we're going to start putting some folks inside here. Getting, uh, oh, actually, you know what? We need money, but we don't have enough chicks, man. We're not going to interrupt any training. However, you know what I can do, guys? So I don't interrupt the money. I'm going to go ahead and let her go up there. Have a bambino. And do we have another chick somewhere else? That's why it's always good to have a guy and a girl somewhere else. In, in, in one of the tr in one of the actual main areas. All right, so these girls can all get it right now. Let's go ahead and get them all. Get them all up in there. Get in there, girls. We need cash, but we don't need it that bad. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and beg. Let's go ahead and get some resources here. Beg, request, boom, done. All right, cool. So this alliance is cool. There's people that are active. They give me they give me cash, so it's not even an issue right there getting that. So we got two females. Yep, there they go. So within an hour or so, hour and a half, we'll just get those guys rotated back out and we'll get some other girls rotated back in. So hopefully when we have the kids, well, there'll they'll be some uh, some extra stars. We'll worry about stars later. Right now, that's not even an issue. We have to get our population up and we can always expel the ones that have less um, stars. But right now, we're going to focus on getting our population up so we can get the training going and rotate that stuff in and out because it's necessary. And I should have probably put the cooks. I should have probably moved the cooks around a little bit. All right, so this guy does not have any Tesla towers. We have some special things here. Let's go ahead and, ooh, it explodes them. I haven't ever used any. All right, so they did put a little hurt down on us a little bit, but it's all good. Didn't really hurt us too much. All right, so we'll go back to the armory. Let's put these cooks in here and train. Let me see, these guys are, they're good, but we don't need food so much right now. Oh. We're in the wrong spot. Let's move these guys in here so they can build. Get this stuff built. Got to cut down the time just a little bit. All right. So the next thing I'll probably build is going to be... We need to get... Oh, we need to upgrade a lot of stuff. So that's what we're going to have to start doing. We only have one builder right now, which is okay. It's not a big deal. It's just going to be a little bit longer to get some stuff done. Not a big deal, though. All right, so this fighter chick is going to have to go ahead and have a kid, too. Both these fighter chicks are going to have to have kids. Um, the fighting is already maxed out to 20. We need 21 so we can equip a lot of this new gear. But we're going to just, you know, keep what we have. It's not a big deal. Oh, we can add supplies. Let's go ahead and add some supplies. I'm not sure which one I like yet. Let's add that. And then what we'll do is produce some more of these little grenade things. They're actually pretty good. And some more grade A, well, actually production not possible. Now, if we were premium, which is like five dollars for thirty days or three dollars ninety nine cents for thirty days, which is a good good deal, we would have to we can put we can put more in here, which is okay. I'm not I may do it. I don't know yet. So we'll go ahead and scout right now, 
And we're gonna more than likely murder these guys with no issues. There's only two of them, so yeah. <laughs> if we lose the two, oh, he's got the, the little Gatling gun looking thing too. So that's gonna be a little, um, we may lose one guy. Nope, maybe not. That's what's up. And I haven't really been attacked as much as I thought I was going to be. So I'm not really worried about it, guys. It's, it's one of those things where you get in there, you get out. You do your thing, and that's pretty much it. All right, so what I'm going to do, more than likely, I'm going to put one of these other guys. Because I want to keep this. I don't want to stop the money production. So let me see what this guy is doing right here. So we're going to take all his gear off. We're going to make him a money dude. Make him a money dude. Because, like I said, we can do training, so it's not a big deal. And we're going to move her out. So, like I said, I don't want to have too many females in one spot. Like, that will stop production of the money. Like, we're going to have one female cook. And that's what I'm going to do also. I'm going to move one of the cooks, too. So, it'll be like, hmm. Because cooks aren't really needed. Like, I've noticed, like, especially if you guys have ever played Hustle Castle, you always have food. You always have a good amount of food. You know, you don't really need it. So let's go ahead and equip this dude up as much as we can. Put the, the little uniform on there. He looks like a little hillbilly, actually. <laughs> uh, there's nothing there. It's all defensive stuff. Um, nothing else there. That's pretty much that. And let's take off her gear. Let's unequip that. And she's going to be in the chemical suit. Yeah, let's go ahead. Why, not? Why can't she not equip that? Alright, so she doesn't have to have anything on right now, so that's fine. So let's keep her right there. Alright, so we're going to do that, and then we're going to do one of the cooks as well. So let's take hers off. Let's put her in here with the cooks right now. And then we're going to move. Let me see which one has the most. He has four cooks. That's why I better not do it. I better not screw myself on that. All right. So let's take his stuff off. <clears throat> the ladle and everything else like that. And he's going to become a money guy. Wherever he went. These guys are walking inside each other. That's kind of weird. He's going to be money. There we go. Let's equip this dude up real fast. If we can. Put some stuff on quickly. And I don't think there's anything as far as the money goes. So we got to make sure we have these guys equipped for the right situation. That's all we got to do. And I wish they made it a little bit easier, but they did not. So there we go. We're going to have female in every quadrant. And I have two female fighters, which is good. But it really does kind of um, mess up our situation just a little bit. All right. So I'm not going to really put her in training. I'll put another guy in training. Let me see. What is he? So what is that research for? I don't even know what the research is for, to be honest with you guys. However, we're going to go ahead and put our guy here for training because we got to train his, uh, train him up a little bit because we got to get more money. Yeah. And that cash is going to come in so fast. Look how much money we got already so far, guys. And that's just from having these guys train. All right. So once we get that stuff built, I can't wait, guys. All right, let's go back for another battle here. We're going to go ahead and kill some of these guys. Not kill them, some of them. We're going to kill all of them. Going just like this. Going just like that. All right, so hopefully we don't have to use any special abilities or anything like that. Oh, they got a Gatling gun, too. God. So it's going to be kind of kind of ouchy a little bit on somebody. And I really need to go back into main mission, but I can't go past level 21. I have so much new gear that I can't even equip. <clears throat> And that's going to make this a lot easier, guys. All right, so go back home. Get this stuff going here. We may have to get premium. I don't know yet. All right, so about hour 23 minutes, these guys are going to be uh, copulated. Copulatory. Yes. Money is coming in. So we'll have another, another thing of, of money coming in. And then all we're going to probably do is upgrade. Now, the experimental lab, I don't understand what that is. This room allows you to uh, train researcher class to hire a class. More researcher produces. Okay, it's so a researcher. Hmm. I guess that's for these guys. 
Yeah, I think it's these guys. They're training. So more than likely, we're going to move everything back up to the top. Let's do that. Let's move this out of here. I think it's theirs. Let's move this. Place it there. I really want the command center up on the very top, but it's okay. A lot of these, these things are not even necessary. This is storage. Let's move that. Let's move that. Um, agent store. There we go. It's all storage so far. Until we get some more of that. So let's keep that there. That storage is good. And since we have a lot of this already, let's go ahead and start training these guys up. Let's train these two. So it just makes more sense just to train them up. To hopefully get another room here. Let's see, command center is right here. So I mean, so shelter editor, you can do it that way. So we need 270,000 bucks. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Let's go from the battle. Going little by little, guys. Little by little. We can murder all these guys. It's not even an issue. Oh, they're all shooting too. <laughs> oh man. And that's a good way to go. There's not really a right or wrong, guys. I like to have two infantry and a, and someone shooting is good, but one infantry and two shooting is even better. But it's not right or wrong. Now you can put the chemical guys in there too, so they can put their little throw their little chemical burns on people. You could do that too. It's not really an issue. Let's go for another one. We're not full on energy, but who cares? We don't need it. It's not gonna not gonna make or break us. Ooh, this guy's 59. I'm gonna chance it on this one. As long as he doesn't have a Gatling gun, which he does. Oh man. Yeah, their gear. They got the gear that I have, but I can't equip it yet. Man, we're going to lose this battle badly. And I'm not even going to use specials because it's not even worth it. Look at this. We still haven't gotten one down. He's healing, too. That's not fair, brother. Mm, mm, mm. That sucks. Well, that sucks, my brothers and sisters. So I can't go in the gym and improve. Can I upgrade this thing? That's what I want to do. Nope. 150,000. I can make some more weapons, but I can't really upgrade anything, really. To be honest with you guys, this is what happened to. Okay, global healing. We need premium. So fit, we can get, we can get the hospital up, but I don't really so much use it. But I do need to get it up. 500,000. If you guys ever get stuck on what to upgrade, just click on the on the top right, and you'll see the. Um, deal here. The dining hall, 42,000. We're going to have to do that. We're going to have to upgrade these things in order. I'm going to do that this time around because I used to just skip and then like, oh, let me go ahead and save 30,000 and then 40, whatever the case is. I used to do that, but I'm not going to do that anymore. Not this time around. And everybody, all my dwellers are happy, which is good. Cash collected 5%, regen uh, collected 5%, and food collected 5%. So everything is 5%, which is great. There's no issues there. So we're okay. All right, guys, we're going to wrap this one up. Like, comment, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.